car. Hello? Uh, help? I'm being held hostage in the main control room just ahead of your current position. Any chance you could, you know, rescue me? The bloody scabs will eat me when they realise I'm not what I say I am. to see you. Here I was doing some help yourself exploring, working on a pet project I've been cooking up when the scav swept in about to cut me up bad when I persuaded them I'm a medic. I am a doctor, but more the Hyperion R&D kind. Um, hey Jack, uh, is this guy for real? I don't recognize him. Yo, what's your name? Ah, uh, sorry bruv, Gladstone Katoa, D Division. What brings you here? Oh, D Division, that's where they hide all the brainiacs who work on the, all the super secret awesome stuff, right? Uh, I work on experimental tech. The Division Green let me using the resources here. Why are you here? Well, Gladstone Katoa, I need to get back to Helios and retake the big-ass laser on it from a bunch of freaky-looking doll military types. And if we don't, the moon's gonna go boom and take half of Pandora with it. You know, the huge. Oh, man. I wondered what was going on. So, why are you here? Shouldn't you be somewhere more space stationing? Jack wants to build a robot army driven by my AI, then retake Helios with it. I'm Felicity, by the way. Oh. Gotcha. You're after my prototype. Well, it's not finished. What? No, we're here to build robots. What prototype are you talking about? Oh, right. I was working on an uh, off-the-books project, creating a master bot capable of digistructing an almost unlimited supply of other bots. My prototype's almost done, but the scav stopped me from installing some key parts. Besides, I wouldn't want something that powerful to fall into their grimy hands. This guy? This guy right here? Tell me more. Yeah, bruv. We'll just need to finish putting the hardware together. After that, install a military-grade AI and pow! It should pump out combat-ready loaders. Way ahead of you, man. What do you think old Felicity is here for? What? You want me inside some kind of constructor bot? That's not what I had in mind. Ooh, constructor. I like it. Nice. So, uh, tech dude, this prototype can digestruct combat loaders, right? Because, to be honest, those power suits seem kind of lame. Yeah, totally. But first, you'll need to finish putting together the prototype. You'll need to get access to the main bot factory itself through the transportation gate. I'll monitor the systems from here. All right. Go Team Robot Army. Do I not get a say in this? Sure, yeah, whatever makes you happy, just make my loaders deadly. By the way, last guy who double-crossed me has got nothing but a bunch of bullet holes and a stupid look on his face. Get me? Why would I cross you, bruv? You're trying to save the moon and you seem like a stand-up guy. Plus, you're about to help me complete my life's work. Bye. 
Resources on Helios for my project. And there was all this old dial tech just left lying around. They gave me an escort team, but the scavs chewed them up pretty quick. I wonder if that's what happened to them. Anyway, then I was on my own. I knew they'd send a rescue party though. Never stopped hoping. Ah, uh, yeah, hey, but you're Hyperion. Oh, bruv, they're the coolest company. Best three years of my life. Would never want to work for anyone else. You picked a winner here, Felicity. I don't want to count talks before they're hatched, but you know what? Yeah. I think you're right. Ah, uh -huh, that'll be fun.
Light him up! Yeah. Our compound loader is gonna be way more kick ass. Speaking of which, how's that going? Welcome, customer. Lovely. May it keep you safe in your travels. My new robot army, huh? Yeah, this is where I was doing most of my work before the scavs came and forced me to be their medic. We'll need to clear the area of them before getting to work. like a junkyard. Are you sure we can build something badass up in here? Of course, Prof. The scabs make it look way worse than it is. First thing we need to do is restore the main power. Head over to the breaker room and see what's what. See if I can get the cover down. Hey, dog hunter! Piss off! Those guys are rude. 
Looks like staffs have barricaded themselves inside. That security glass is vulnerable to cold. Reckon you should freeze and smash. Whoa, shrinking, shrinking. The pace of should be in this room. Just flip it on. Oh, sorry. That electrify the water. At least this place has power now. That, good people, is the sound of progress. One step closer to saving the world. Okay, let's get down to serious business now. The first thing we need to do is complete the eye part. That's the really clever bit. I already have the process set up, but we'll need the material from a few of the security bots. I was never able to get them myself. Well, let me guess. All brains, no balls. <laughs> yeah, something like that. The little buggers back quite a punch. Head back to the security office that looks over the main room and call them in. Of course, that might attract more scabs too, so be prepared. It should already be set up. materials and form the prototype eye. An eye converter? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard of. Why the hell would they make an eye converter? They didn't make it. I did. I was here for a long time preparing this lab for my prototype. This is highly sensitive experimental technology. Really? Because it looks like a toaster. There it goes. All my hard work finally paying off. We're seeing history in the making. So beautiful. Okay, now pick it up. Oh, cool. Okay, now head back to the main room. We need to plug that baby into the main torso. Flip that latch and the cage should open. This is what we're building. I was so close to finishing this when the scabs arrived. It'll pump out a lot of robots, enough to make the difference against Dahl or whatever they are. Oh, it's, uh, looks kind of like a dumpster wrapped in sadness. Hey, no offense. This constructor will be able to digistrate highly complex machines at an unsurpassed rate. Now that's done, we need to mount the torso onto the crane system. said I'd never amount to anything, but she was wrong. And now look at me. You want me inside that thing? I've been wondering about this installation. You know, you could just copy me. It takes a little longer, but it's the same thing, and I'd find it much less terrifying. Exactly how much less terrifying? 
It's the difference between brain surgery and being scanned. Uh, let me think about it. That's good, that's good. Now we need to attach the turrets, then the legs. targeting systems. Oh, that's okay, thanks. I've got a fast way to do that. Okay, scared. Just soften them up a little. Then let the turrets work their magic. The turrets need to get the kills for you. The clock's... Need to finish them off, or they won't calibrate. Turrets now at 50% accuracy. Get in there. I swear, bro. Nice play. You get it because he's frozen.
Huh. Not sure I want to move in. Right. The legs are in the other lab. They're still attached to an experimental version of the dial power suit. So you'll need to separate them and get them into the crane system. How about I take over the power suit, then walk the legs to where they can be assembled? Wouldn't that be easier? Hey, that's not a bad idea. I didn't even think of that. It'll be a nice warm-up for you. Awesome. It got awesome. 
massive route, isn't it? Construction's complete, finally! The shell just needs to go through testing in the diagnostics chamber. Am I too we'll be able to install the AI core you? Felicity there. No, Jack, I really didn't enjoy killing those scabs. Maybe this is all a mistake. I don't like killing either, babe. Prototype is on its way to the testing chamber. Head on over there so we can install our AI. Okie dokie, tickety tock, let's do this. He's not moving anytime soon. it by then. Look, I'm really sorry, kiddo. This is the only way. Vault Hunter, do it. Um, I, I guess it's for the best. And the world just got 20...
Is he still in there? Look, we need that thing attacked. Disable it, but don't destroy it. Give me another jack! Stuff needs a kick in the pants, too. Let me get that down. Think up awesome new names and colors for Hyperion weapons. All right, I think we're good to go. Come back to Moxie's, we'll get you geared up and ready for the big fight. 